Hello everyone and welcome to the course of KPIF. In this we are going to discuss about CAPIF. So what is KPIF? This course by Telcoma will cover all the topics which are there in the KPIF. This is Common API Framework. So KPIF stands for Common API Application Programming Interface Framework. So it is a programming application programming interface function and introduced by the 3GPP. Why it is introduced by the 3GPP? The introduction of the KPIF is uh, because we can have a unified north bound API framework across the several 3GPP functions. As 3GPP has defined the number of functions, so basic motive of introduction of the KPIF so that we have a unified uh, framework across different 3GPP functions. So, with the standardization of this, the 3GPP has addressed a variety of different purposes. Now, if we talk about the different purposes like onboarding, offboarding, offloading and onboarding of the different functions, like we onboard some, we offload some of the application functions, there is service discovery and management, event subscription and notification as well as security and charging of various application functions. So here in KPIF there is a single and harmonized approach. There is a single approach for the API development and it has a number of 3GPP specifications on the work. So this is basically to specify a framework so that it can host APIs of the PLMN and it also allows for the third parties so that it can leverage this framework to host their different APIs. So this is basically to specify a framework so that it can host the number of APIs of the PLMN and also it can allow the different third parties to leverage this framework to host their different APIs. So this was basically delivered in release 15 and all the enhancements are there in the release 16. KPIF was in, uh, integrated with the northbound API which was developed by 3GPP SA2 like network exposure function and SA4 which have extreme mobile broadband services. So this is basically what is KPIF and why it is introduced. Thank you.